Drivers who use a popular bridge to pass through Chester and Union counties will now be adding about 35 miles to their commute. Wow. Next Monday, the Broad River Bridge is going to close for a month for structural repairs. 7 News reporter Dave Jordan is live in Lockhart tonight. He has details on what this is going to mean for first responders as well. What have you found out, Dave? Well, Tom and Amy, this is the bridge behind me. This is a bridge that is traveled by 5,000 people every single day, shuttling back and forth between Chester and Union counties. It will be closed next week for repairs, which is an inconvenience for drivers, but it's also forcing first responders to come up with a contingency plan to keep residents safe. Residents in Chester and Union counties first learned about the Highway 9 bridge closing down after these signs were posted at both ends earlier this week. We come all the way around. We come all the way around, 35 mile trip just to eat here. That led the owner of the Broad River Mart to close his business for 30 days. When they close the bridge down, we lose all the traffic for coming from Union County and from Chester and all around. This is the major highway through here. The Department of Transportation describes the repairs as minor but necessary. Lockhart Mayor Eileen Ash fielding calls from angry neighbors. People are very upset, but what they've got to realize and what I'm explaining to them is that they're doing this so they can get the new bridge built. The detour will take you around Highway 49, 211, back down 105. Ed Darby, the deputy director of emergency management in Chester County, showed us the 35-mile detour drivers will have to take. His agency also has a plan in place on how to respond to 911 calls. Darby says those calls will be routed to departments closest to where the incidents occur on both sides of the Broad River. He's not too worried about how they will be handled, but there is an area of concern. Our main concern is fire suppression. That's because there are no hydrants on the Chester County side of the bridge. Union County always provides water for firefighters, and that will be inaccessible once the bridge is shut down. But we're going to have to rely on tanker shuttles to supply water. And I'm told that the repairs to the Broad River Bridge will end on August 14th. We're live tonight in Lockhart, South Carolina. Dave Jordan, 7 News. Thank you, Dave.